वेलकम डियर स्टूडेंट माई सेल्फ प्राची जैन एंड आई एम हेयर टू एक्सप्लेन यू चैप्टर वन अ न्यू वर्ल्ड ऑर्डर एज यू ऑल आर नो दैट वी आर फेसिंग अ डेडली वायरस सिंस वन एंड हाफ ईयर फ्रॉम मार्च टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी दिस डेडली वायरस इज नॉन एज कोरोना वायरस सो ड्यू टू दिस पैंडमिक टाइम वी गॉट some drastic changing in our life our life are completely changed due to this coronavirus we become virtual for more, so many platforms as we are now shopping online we are now do studies online this chapter basically tell us about a special day the day is 5 april 2020 20 the day when the prime minister of india mr narendra damodar das modi ji who declare that on 5 april 2020 20 at 9 pm we have to lit the ash candles and kept them burning for 9 minutes to show our gratitude for the front line warriors in this chapter there is a society named sahodya and clay and the activities done on 5 april 2020 20, 20 that are shown in this chapter there is a family known as mathurs there are two children priya and rajat of mathur family on 5 april they are on dining table without having been called repeatedly they are not complaining about the food even they are thanks their mother for making some delicious food at 8:55 pm all the residents all people of sahodya and cleve come on their balconies their ramdas of their house and they arranging the ash candles torch lights all of them in a series they all are look so excited they are ready to show our thanks they are ready to show their thanks and their gratitude to the front line warriors and these front line warriors are doctors nurses healthcare workers paramedics ambulance drivers and street vendors who are always ready to provide their services to us in the pandemic the full form of corona virus is fever acute respiratory syndrome corona virus it means the corona virus is a disease which is belong to the respiratory system and the front line warriors and the front line warriors they are always ready to provide their service to us they are like the shield to all of us we are become safe at our home just because of their restless duties then the time arrived it means it began 9 o'clock all the people of sahodya and clave lit the ash candles torch lights their mobile flashlights everything they can and the light of whole country has been cut then there is a conversation start between the peoples of uh, sahodya and clave between the peoples of mathur's family first of all rajat said that the front line warriors are so brave that they ventured out they wandered out in every infected area so that we can stay at our home so comfortably and be safe then his grandfather agrees with his words and tell them that they are doing their duty 16 and 18 hours and they cannot meet their families as we all are know that there are some of the teachers some of the doctors some of the nurses are there who can't meet their families their newborn babies also in that pandemic then priya said i can also heard about the ambulance drivers who are also perform their duties day and night without any rest then their grandmother is also added about the healthcare workers who who disinfect all localities and who dispose the waste materials very meticulously now their father added don't forget their father tell both of them that you cannot forget your teachers who make your studies online informative and innovative for you so that you can understand each and everything very clearly everyone was quiet for some time and they are thinking about the drastic changes that had that has changed their life in the pandemic the first lockdown 
was started from 25th of March 2020. The Mr. Mathur, who would travel frequently on official business, was working from home now, and his wife Anjali, who was also a computer engineer, now they are at home and they can give their time to their childrens also. And all the childrens and all the persons are communicating with their friends on by by mobile phone. by doing phone and video calls now there in this uh, page there are the some activities which we are all following in the pandemic like when we have to go out then we have to put a mask every time we have to sanitize our hand and we have to sanitize our hand with at least for 20 seconds when we come back at our home so we have to put our clothes and our shoes out of the house and we have to put our clothes for the washing immediately we have to wash our hands and wash all the purchase items truly when we are outside we have to maintain a 2 meter social distancing from each and every person it is compulsory for all of us to wear our mask when we are sneezing or coughing we have to cover our face and our mouth with our nose and our mouth with a tissue paper and send and through them tissue papers in a separate dustbin when these activities are done in the country the front line warriors are performing their duties day and night without any rest and we cannot forget our policemen who are always ready to support us who are wandering on the street so that no one can go out from their house in this pandemic we are also learned something that we have a valuable time we know about the importance of that time the time can change everything but we always learn some new things from this life some of the people are always ready to help their neighbors the neighbors who are very elderly who can't go outside for their initial needs for their essential needs also that's why we are no every every neighbor helping each and every person they are buying essential items for the grand persons for the senior citizens like groceries medicines vegetables and fruits we all are give our precious time to our family and we are also learned so many valuable lesson from this pandemic time but priya had said her mother that he is also learned a valuable lesson that nothing can defeat us if we have the will to overpower it Rajat also share that Priya and Rajat both are decided that they are going to donate their saving to continue this determined fight against COVID nineteen. We all are ready to fight against this COVID nineteen. Although we are sitting at our home, but we all are each and every person of the country hopes that we are. defeat this covid 19 and we are done this thank you and have a good day